Thanks, you too. 546 right now. A bit of a throwback Thursday in Vancouver yesterday as former Prime Minister Jean Chrétien was in town showing support for local Liberal candidates. Chrétien spoke about foreign relations and says the West should welcome any efforts by Russian President Vladimir Putin to help with the military offensive in Syria. He also spoke about campaigning in a federal election in the year 2015. Social media obviously was not an issue when he had to worry about it during his time in Ottawa. Because you sometimes you said something stupid, that doesn't mean that you, you should be on a penalty box for the rest of your life. But when they resign, it's because they decided to resign. Simon Fraser University has opened a new innovation facility in downtown Vancouver. This was the opening of SFU's Venture Labs. The 24,000 square foot space is the West Coast hub of a new pan-Canadian business accelerator network. Some of the technology that has been installed here includes sensors that measure moisture content in farm fields and a football helmet decal that prevents head and brain injuries. There's also software that literally composes and performs music on command. Yeah, that's where Venture Lab has been really useful. Um, as we learn how to develop and grow a new company, they're helping us uh, with tip, but we also got um, help with uh, the lawyer and the legal uh, dimension of the company, as well as uh, a little bit of help with branding and communication. So that has been very, very useful. Well, he's a big player in the local creative economy, and now he has been honored with a very prestigious award. Lionsgate founder Frank Dustra received a standing ovation at the Vancouver Board of Trade as he was presented with the inaugural VIF Screen Industry Builder Award. This award recognizes leaders who showcase Vancouver as a destination for excellence and innovation in screen-based media. It's also designed to celebrate the accomplishments, contributions, and future potential that our province has to offer both on and off screen. You know, I travel all over the world, and when people ask me where I'm from, I always say, well, Vancouver, and I get one of two responses. If they haven't been here, they go, wow, I hear it's an amazing city. And if they've been here, they said, you know, you're really lucky you live in such a beautiful city. And it's true. I am so privileged and honored to be part of this business community. And thank you. Thank you very much. Congratulations.